Hi friends, it's me. Coming today with your small group, we're gonna be talking about comparing and measuring. So in order to do this activity, um, we're gonna play a game called Huff and Puff. So I have some materials here. You see I have some Uno cards, I have a cotton ball, a paper ball, and I have some uh, tape measure. And we're gonna use the tape measure as well as the Uno cards to measure how far I can blow the ball. And then we're gonna see which one was able to be blown the farthest, okay? So, in my Uno cards, I had to stack them one in front of the other and making sure they're touched, all right? So we're gonna first start with the cotton ball. I'm gonna make sure to start right here at the beginning. And then I'm going to blow to see how far I can blow the cotton ball. Are you ready? One, two, Three. Did you see it blow? Did you see it roll? All right, so let's see. If we look at the tape measure first, I was able to blow the cotton ball to 11, 11 inches. If we measure using Uno cards, let's see. I'm gonna kind of smooth it over up. So we have one, two, three. Kind of like at the top of three, the beginning of four. All right, so. I'm going to put it on this side so we can remember where it was. Now, I'm going to do the paper ball and see how far I can blow it. Now, which one do you think will go the farthest? The cotton ball or the paper ball? Let's see. Ready? One, two, three. <gasps> I couldn't move the paper ball. It would not move. So which one would go the farthest? The cotton paper ball, which didn't move at all, or the cotton ball, which kind of stopped at number 11? Right, the cotton ball was able to go the farthest. Now I wonder why, as I pick both of them up and I hold them in my hand, feel the cotton ball, I'm gonna feel the paper ball. Hmm, the paper ball, paper ball seems a little heavier than the cotton ball. So that's probably why it was harder for me to blow it. But I have something that I'm pretty sure is gonna help me blow it. I have, what is that? It's a hair dryer. And we're gonna use this hair dryer to see which one will be able, see, let's see it first if we'll be able to move the paper ball and then we'll see which one will go the farthest using the hair dryer, okay? I had to make sure it was on. All right, are you ready? One, two, three. <gasps> look how far the cotton ball went. And look at the paper ball. It's still, it moves some, but not as far. All right, so the paper ball stopped at about number eight. And then one, two Uno cards. Let's count. Look how far that cotton ball is. So let's kind of slide it over here so we can see exactly how far up it went. So we're gonna count one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine Uno cards. And then we look over here, it went 31 inches. So during my experiment or during my game, I was able to see between the two balls I had, which was a cotton ball and the paper ball, that the cotton ball went the farthest. And the paper ball did not because it was a little heavy. So I want you to get two balls at your house and I want you to play the game Huff and Puff and see which ball would go the farthest. And if you don't have tape measure, it's fine. I see I use Uno cards to measure mine. You can use anything in your house to measure. Let me see, you probably have some blocks maybe. Or what about some, you can line the crayons up to see how many crayons it can blow to. Or you can do your shoes. You can use anything to measure with, okay? All right, have fun measuring.